Um, you know, could you, one domestic, one international, please. Uh, on the domestic question, could you give us a little bit more clarity on this with or without Congress? Mm -hmm. Because it's being interpreted by some, Gingrich, for example, as virtually a modern view. The president says, you know, can't work with Congress, I'll do it myself. And there's a lot of criticism. Could it, if you can explain exactly, you know, what the idea of that is, and whether it could backfire, whether it would look as if he is trying to just ignore Congress, and then we can get into the international. Sure, no, I appreciate the question. I, I, we have made clear, and the President has made clear for a long time now, that he will do whatever he can to help the economy, to help it grow, to help it create jobs, to protect the middle class. And when Congress refuses to act, when Republicans choose the path of obstruction rather than cooperation, then the President's not going to sit here. This gridlock in Washington is not an excuse for inaction. He's going to take the actions that he can take using his executive authority uh, to help the cause here, to help uh, Americans deal with this challenging economy. And they can be small, medium, or large actions. And, and they don't have to be just executive authority actions. They can be things that we can do working with the private sector. Uh, so, you know, it's, it's, he'll pursue all tracks.